stayed mostly dry. Our friends in North Louisiana still getting some storms and you can see how some showers were trying to reach southwest Mississippi, but this is actually going to be the trend the next couple of days. It's going to stay active to our north to our northeast and you can see this is severe threat day one. So that's today and it does include our our uh, areas along and north of the 10 and 12 just in case a couple of storms start to drift more to the south. Same for our Wednesday. You could see that level one risk along and north of the 10 and 12 and then Thursday it lifts a little to the north. But the reason why even though we are expecting our rain chances to be lower, it's because of storm complexes. Th these passing disturbances could trigger some showers and storms and if some of these storms just continue to uh, drift more to the south they could clip some of our areas so we'll have to watch for those but either way rain chances are going to be very low the next couple of days showing you on the GFS this is what I mean you see how some of these storms are staying more to our north but then it shows Thursday a couple of storms could drift to the south staying along and north of the 10 and 12 and that could certainly be the case you notice how they're staying more to the north and east and really the timing of this would be in the afternoon but this for the next seven days really paints that picture showing one hundredth of an inch of rain over the next seven days where as you get more to the north and east five to seven inches of rain so while our friends up north and northeast will stay under a very active weather pattern we're going to be in this really hot and stagnant weather pattern and as I mentioned a couple of storms could creep into our area but most of us are going to stay dry and hot, very hot, especially as that high pressure uh, moves more to the north. We're hot right now, but not as hot as where we could be. 95 was our official high today. Tonight, 76 degrees. Tomorrow, about 96 degrees. You see between 94 and Macomb down to Napoleonville, 92 and Plaquemine, 97 degrees. But our feels like temperatures are going to be well into the triple digits. And like I mentioned, not much in the way of relief from the heat. So over the next seven days because of this ridge of high pressure, this heat dome, if you will, our temperatures are going to go up our humidity is going to go up later in the week and so you factor in a high of 99 close to 100 it's going to feel well into the 100s the 110s even and this is excessive heat warning criteria we don't officially have any heat alerts in place but that could certainly change we'll see what the national weather service says for tomorrow heat advisory may be possible could be possible on thursday likely going to be the case at least heat advisories over the weekend, if not those excessive heat warnings. So we'll have to watch and see, but 